Anyway, what are we going to talk about today, people? What are we going to talk about today? I'm going to tell you what we're going to talk about today. We're going to talk about how to get your mind right for this cryptocurrency trading investment thingamajig that some of you may be thinking, yeah, I want to do it. I want to get my feet wet, but I'm not sure, you know, you're you're a bit flaky. Go and put your big boy pants on, innit? Go and put your big girl dress on, yeah? No time to be flaky in this realm. No time, yeah? Right, serious times, people. Let's get it. All right. First thing is first. You've got to get your mind right, right? You have to get your mind right. When you see prices in this crypto space go up 30, 40, 50 percent, or go down 30, 40, 50, etc. percent in a day, you can't be panicking. You, got, you, you have to control your emotions because this crypto ecosphere, trading, investing, Take your emotions on a serious ride. And if you ain't a strong person, you're gonna get your ass torn a new one. You're gonna get wrecked, people. You're gonna lose your money. You're gonna sell low. You're gonna buy high and sell low. And that's not the way to do it. You don't buy high and sell low. You lose money like that, people. You buy low and sell high. Duh. Jeez, man. What's wrong with you people, man? Buy low, sell high. Yeah? Get it? Get it? But you have to know what a low price is. And you have to know what a high price is, depending on what you're buying, isn't it? So it's all about learning, people. Because if you buy high and sell low, you're going to get wrecked. And then you're going to moan at your brother from another mother, say, ah, he doesn't know what he's talking about. He's fake. Let me tell you something, yeah? Let me tell you something. I've been in this game since 2017. October, stroke, November 2017. I've seen the highs, I've seen the lows, right? I know what I'm talking about. I ain't no expert, right? I don't claim to be no expert, first and foremost. All I claim to know what I know. So I'm sharing with you guys what I know. You can take it or leave it. I'm just trying to help the average Joe out here. The underdog who needs a helping hand. Because right now, whatever government, society, country you're in on the planet, most of you are getting shafted, mate, right? You're getting torn a new one. And right now, we are fed up, right? You're on furlough, you lost your job, all this crap, right? It's not right. You need help. And your brother from another mother is here to help you. If you listen, and if you take the steps, right, you'd be all right. So, first and foremost, you've got to get your head right. You've got to get your mind right. You've got to learn to control your emotions. If you don't, as I said, you're going to get wrecked, right? So, I'm going to put a link in the description of a place where you can purchase books to get your mind right, yeah? One of these places is based in London, Croydon. Um, the shop is called Nashat. I'll put the link in the description. You can check them out. They've got a whole load of books there. Yeah? Um, health, health um, goods, clothes, great source, right? So you can go and check them out. And they may have the mind scroll, and they may have your potential scroll. These are two books I recommend to get your mind on a certain level, par, point, and your potential. That's another good book to dig into yourself and get your potential up to a level where it's gonna benefit you more than it is now. Yes, yeah, so another two good books. And I'm going to be recommending books throughout these video series, right, to help you along your path, your journey. 
this great journey that we all going through. Yeah, the information age, the golden era, the Aquarius age, being called by many names, but yeah, we'll get into that in another bit. So, those are two heads up. Your Potential book and the Mind book. Right? Those are two very good references, sources that you will not be disappointed, people. They were written over 20 years ago by Dr. Malachi C. York, the most profound writer on the planet. Woo! Jeez! Potent, people! Potent! His info is so potent, it gets me gassed. It gets me railed up, I've got to say. Let me slow down, let me calm down. Do some, let me do some meditation. Done it. Yeah, cool, I'm back. Right, anyway, yeah, as I was saying, check those books out. Links will be in the description. Um, yeah, well, right, next week. You are living in the greatest time to be alive in our existence, people. Serious thing, I'm not even joking. It's a great time to be alive. Right, you see, look, 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 the sun is shining. We live in L London, England, right? And the sun has been shining since March. Okay, we've been in the... So run, people, man. It's not normal. It's not normal in London. Yeah? It ain't normal. But it is now. Why? Because we're in the sun cycle, people. If you don't know what that cycle is, again, check out some of Dr. Malachi Z. York's books. And you're going to find all that info. Yeah? You'd be ahead of the crowd instead of being a laggard. Don't be late to the party. Be first to the party. Right? Come on, people. Right. So, as I said, let's go back to crypto. Now, if you get into Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies now, it's like you getting into the mobile phone business Back in like 1990, Yeah, people, you you heard me. I said it. It's like you getting into the mobile phone industry in night in the early 90s. If you did, and you set and you had set up a business around mobile phones, selling mobile phones, accessories, accessories, whatever, you've been quite well off now. Right now, you've been you know financially independent as long as you've done the right thing with the money. Yeah? Because not, it's not when you make money, it's not how you're making money. It's easy to make money. Can you keep it? It's like, what are you doing to keep it? That's, the, that's, it. that's important too. Making the money, but make sure you keep it, man. Make sure you put it in places. That's going to grow for you, people. That's going to work for you. You send the pound note or your dollar out to work. Yeah? Like Massa, did the slaves back in the day, the kidnapped, kidnap our people, our ancestors, and send them to work, innit? Yo, boy. Or plant some cotton for me, boy. Yeah? Chop some, chop some sugar cane. Yeah? I need sugar. I got a sweet tooth. Gotta make this money, boy. Yes, massa. Sure, massa. Three bags, four, massa. Anything you say, massa. Yeah? Not nowadays, people. Massa get his head taken off. Yeah? Ain't got time for Massa. Yeah? Massa's days are over. It's over, Massa. Yeah? Freedom at last, Massa. Freedom at last. Slaves are free. The kidnappings are free. Why? It's our time, baby. It's our time. Your time is done. Over. Kaput. Later. Alright, people, let me get back to my. Now, let, me, let, me get, let, me, let me stay in composure, man. I'm getting too excited right now. I'm getting excited. I'm getting excited. Anyway, right. I'm twitching, man. I'm twitching. I'm twitching. I'm twitching. <laughs> anyway, as I said, getting in cryptocurrency right now is like you buying a mobile phone in 1993 and you're setting up a mobile phone shop and you start selling phones. Why? Because back in 1993, 92, I put my I had a I had a mobile phone. Yeah? And at that time, I only found this out the other day. At that time, there was around 30, 40 million people on the planet that had a mobile phone. Yeah! 
you heard me. 30 to 40 million people that had a mobile phone. Yeah? Now, if I had the brains, right? Obviously I didn't because I was too dense back then. If I had the brains or somebody came and said, hey brother from another mother, you know, if you start selling those devices, you're gonna make some crazy money. If somebody come and came and told me that, maybe, just maybe I would have got into that market. But unfortunately I missed that boat. Just like I missed the internet boat as well, the dot com bubble. Just like I missed Google. Just like I missed Amazon. Just like I missed Bitcoin three times and it, well, I came across it three times before I started in 2017. First time when it was less than a dollar. Second time when it was around a hundred dollars. Third time when it was around five hundred dollars, people. Don't be a fool like your brother from another mother. Please, people, don't be dense like lead, like me. Back in the day, please don't do it. That's why I'm doing these videos to save your scrawny asses. Yeah? Do these videos for you, not for me. I'm doing it for me as well, but for you as well. Yeah? It's a win-win situation. Is that right? Truth be told. Right. So don't be an asshole like me. Get in there early. Do your research. And you won't be disappointing people. Why? 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 Why do you say that, brother, from another mother? Why? I'll tell you why. Because if you get into this crypto thing now, it's like you getting into the mobile phones back in the day. That's right. Why? Because only around 50... Around 50 million people that's involved in cryptocurrency worldwide, people. There's 7 billion people on the planet. Do the maths. Yeah? Do the maths. It's not hard to work out, isn't it? Then again, it may be a bit hard because a lot of us went to government school and the government really, you know, massa didn't really teach us that well in school. Because why is it going to teach you information to free the, the you know, the kidnappees? Yeah? It's not going to do that. School system, university, college system in the Western Hemisphere is not going to teach your monkeys, yeah, freedom. He's not going to give you that freedom information, that freedom knowledge. Oh, don't be silly. He wants you working for him. You're a good boy. Nine to five, do your work. Go home, watch TV like a good little citizen. And oh yeah, stay at home because the boogeyman is outside with the big V trying to get me, trying to get you. Stay at home. Don't feed your family. Don't go to work. If you can work, work from home. Yo, Massa told you, Massa. No time for that, Massa. Just having a little rat there, people. I get ratty sometimes, you know. To these people trying to walk in the road, crossing the road. If that was America, with Jay walking right now, you get fined. But this is London, yeah. So it's alright. Anyway, so as I was saying, you get into mobile mobile phones back in the nineties. And you opened up a mobile phone shop, you would have made peng wangi. Peng! Peng, peng, peng! Yeah? So, right now, if you get into the cryptocurrency, you're gonna make peng money. As long as you invest into the right crypto, the right coins, the right tokens. And I'll explain in a later video what is the difference between a coin and a token. I'll explain all that. It's so much. The rabbit hole is deep, people. This rabbit hole. Is deep like getting involved in Wu Sabat. Getting involved in Dr. Malachi Z. York's info. That's how. You go down the rabbit hole, you're not coming back, people. You're not coming back. You take that red pill, you want reality? This is it. This is it. You want the realness? This is it. This channel's for you. If you want some fake ass channel, go ahead, man. I don't care. Go ahead. But this channel's for you, people. Anyway, right, as I was saying, I gotta keep my eyes on the road, obviously. I'm not, I'm not looking at you when I'm driving. Yeah? Can't be looking at you. Gotta stay focused out here. Right, as I was saying, if you get into cryptocurrency now, you're early. I know you may be saying, but brother, from another mother, Bitcoin is 11 years old. Don't worry about that, people. 
Bitcoin is still cheap. I saw Bitcoin go to nineteen and a half thousand dollars in December 2017 or early 2018, January. I saw it with my own eyes, people. I had skin in the game when it went to that figure. Yeah? So right now, Bitcoin at $11,000 and change. It's cheap, people! It's cheap! Oh my gosh, it's cheap! Woo! Now, I know some of you may be saying, I ain't got no $11,000! Brother from another mother, I ain't got $11,000, man! Don't worry, I've got you. I have you. I've got your top, bottom, side, side. I've got you all around, don't worry! You can start off with what you can afford. Disclaimer, you only put money into this thing that you can afford to lose. Danny just ran me, I tell you, sorry, sorry people, these stupid drivers out here. Just a little rant. Yeah, there's a roundabout, I'm, I'm going right. This guy was to come, yo, sorry, a little rant. I, don't know, I get ranty sometimes. Anyway, don't put any money in this market that you can't afford to lose. Please, please people. That's the first rule, yeah? Because you're gonna get wrecked. You would get wrecked. You lose your money. And then you're gonna come back to me, ah, brother from another mother. You told me to invest in this, that, 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 that. And I've lost my money. Don't cry to me. I ain't no investment advisor. I'm only sharing you some, sharing you with some info. That's all. I ain't no financial advisor, yeah? So, you're responsible for your own actions. I am not me. Don't go blaming anyone else for your own actions. Don't be flaky now, yeah? Please, be responsible. That's why I recommended those books. Your potential in your mind. Be responsible for your own decisions in life. Don't blame, go around blaming other people. Don't be weak and fragile. Weak asses out here. I ain't got time for you lot, but I still love you. <laughs> anyway, first rule, you don't put any money that you can't afford to lose, people. Yeah? And you can start off with any money that you have. It doesn't matter how big or how small. You can start off with £10. Yeah, or whatever denomination you whatever denomination that you live in. Dollars, if you live in America, dollars then, yeah? Or whatever. Ten pounds, five pounds. But along, get some skill in the game, people. Because if you ain't got skill in the game, you really ain't gonna know how, what it feels like for the market to go up and down when the market goes up and down in prices. And you know, you're not, you're not gonna really ex feel it, yeah? So you have to have skill in the game, first and foremost. And I said, don't put any money that you can't afford to lose. It's imperative. Serious. Don't put your rent money, your mortgage money, yeah, your baby's nappy's money, your food money. Don't do it. Don't do it, people. Please, don't do it. Don't do it. Because you would get wrecked. I've been there, done it. I'm a high-risk guy. I take risk. I, I'm, I'm, I'm a high-risk guy. I tell you that right now. I'm a risk-taker, yeah? But calculated. But I'm a risk-taker. Right? I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm not afraid of risk. Risk is, is my game. I love risk. Yeah? I love risk. That's where I'm from. But that's another story. <laughs> anyway! So, you got that rule right? Cool. Secondly, every week or every month, put some money in, in put some money in, in the game. Put some skill in the game. Whatever you can afford. Yeah? Buy a little piece of Bitcoin or whatever currency, Ethereum, XRP, buy a little piece, piece by piece. Because I, I, I have found that's one of the best ways to, to build up your investment or you know whatever you're buying. It's the best way. One of the, one of the best ways, I should say. Not the, not the best way. There's not, there's not one way to do anything. But that's a good way. Every month, every week, whatever you can afford, you buy a little piece of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Ripple, whatever. If you don't know what these names, don't worry, I'm gonna do another other video to explain what these different tokens, coins are, so you get a clear understanding, overstanding, inner standing, rounder standing of what it is. You know what I'm saying, people? Yeah? So first and foremost, only put money in the game that you can afford to lose. Secondly, 
dollar or pound cost average every week, every month. Yeah. Thirdly, you've got to do your own research and investigation in blockchain, crypto, all this stuff. Please, you have to do your research because it takes time for your head to get around it, especially if you're not a technical person. If you're not a technical person, yeah? If you're not a geek, come on, people. Sorry, man, this driver. Anyway, if you're not a geek, right? If you're not a geek like me, I'm a bit of a geek, yeah? Um, I like all that stuff. I went to design school, all that stuff, right? So I'm a bit of a geek. I'm not a full geek, but I'm a bit of a geek still. So if you're not a geek and you're not computer savvy, you know, it's going to take a while for you to get your head around certain things. Yeah, you're going to hear certain words. You're not going to know what it means, right? So, yeah, it's going to take you a, a while. So please, people, do your research. That's very important. Do your diligent research. Don't believe a word I'm telling you. Please, don't believe anything I'm telling you on this channel. Please. Yeah? I'm not no guru of crypto and trading and investing. No, man. I'm not no guru, man. You've got your own mind. Use it. Like I'm using my own. Use it, man. We're always giving a mind. Jeez. Get your nine mind on, right, people? For those who know, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway. So those, I'm going to leave it with those three things, yeah? With those three pointers. First point, only put money in the game that you can afford to lose, people. Because if you lose it, and you can afford to lose it, you won't cry. Yeah? Because this game is high risk, but it's high reward. Right? Secondly, dollar cost average, yeah? Or pound cost average every week, every month, every two weeks, every day. Whatever you can afford, doesn't matter what it is. And last of all, do your own research. Do not rely on the information that you're hearing from Ether9 TV, stroke your brother from another mother. Do not rely on me. Rely on yourself, right? Be your own deity. Rely on yourself. Don't rely on anybody else. Cut the third man out of the picture. Take his head off. We don't need him. Uh, it. Yeah? So those are the three points I'm leaving with you today, people. It was meant to be a short video, but sometimes I'll, I'll rant on a bit.